So I thought I'd make a video of the QWAT NV2 on a Jeep Wrangler with larger tires because I hadn't seen too much about that for the uh, particular model of this one, bike rack. So I thought I'd go through it real quick with you so you know the ins and outs of it before you go buy one. Uh, I believe it's $749 for it for the actual Kuat NV2, if I'm not mistaken. Pretty good rack. Uh, there's a bunch of reviews on it, so I don't, I'm not going to go through that. But I just wanted to show you the ins and outs with the larger tire setup and uh, that we had something to go off of. I've got 33-inch tires on this, and I've got the rugged or the uh, barricade rear bumper on here. And with that on there, with this setup, you're looking at your inside bike sitting with the pedal on the inside of the rim if you have enough offset on it. So be aware of that when you do it. And then when you go to put it in, um, you're pretty close to the back of the tire. You probably have about two inches for the rack itself. Uh, tilting away you can still tilt it away it's not a big deal it sits about like that so if you're gonna open the back you can't a whole lot you've got about that much room so probably about probably about four inches five inches maybe okay let's go ahead and get the bike off here and then we'll uh, go ahead and show you with folding it up with this. to fold it up that's about as far as you can get and it is not locked but it'll rest up against there so it looks like they're probably I don't know three inches from going full lock I suppose with the way that angle is but uh, I think I measured it hole to hole when it would lock in it was three inches to the hole where it was sitting at from here so you'd probably have to get I looked at it and you can get a six inch adapter extension from Kurt or Reese hitches when it's 136 bucks Home Depot sells one that's eight inch for 64 I believe and then there's the uh, four inch drop hitch. And I think that's what I might try because I've got plenty of clearance, but you can put it so it's a dry uh, drop or a raise, but something you can look into. But just thought I'd do a quick review of that for you. And if you've got a Wrangler and you're looking to get one of these, they're the one to get. So enjoy. Thanks. Have a good one.